We still have seven wonderful acts to come. I know, yeah. It's very arousing. Are you ready? Yes. Yeah. Connect the uh, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together and welcome warmly to the stage Andreas Schiedhofer! Schmidhofer! Andreas Schiedhofer! Hello! Oh, these are nice acoustics, I like it. So, I am Andreas Schiedhofer. From now on until ever. Um, today I traveled down from Bristol, but originally I am from... No, I'm not gonna tell you. I'm gonna let you guess. Where am I from? Dartford. Hamburg. Wow. <laughs> Well, 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 I heard a few things. I heard Hamburg, which is not so far away. Okay, let's change the question. I won't ask you where I'm from. I will ask you which language am I speaking when ich diese Sprache Deutsch. verwende. Deutsch. German. I'm talking in German. Yeah, I am from Austria, in case you were wondering. Um, but the point is, I do speak German. Now, German speakers have very long words and <laughs> okay 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 so words um the fact uh or the reason why german speakers have long words is because they just put it together let me give you an example um this uh ceiling decoration over there the lighting for it um i can make that one word it's the um Raumdekorationsbeleuchtung. <laughs> and then we could go on if we say uh, the cables for the decoration of uh, no, the cables for the lighting for the decoration. Uh, that's the Raumdekorationsbeleuchtungsverkabelung. <laughs> One word. So now you might ask yourself, <laughs> why do you need to build long words anyway? Imagine the following situation. Somebody asked you to describe yourself in one word. <laughs> then I can basically tell them my whole life story. <laughs> okay, now who of you speaks German? Any German speakers here? The man behind the bar. What's your name? Owen. Owen. You speak German. So can you describe yourself in one word? <laughs> Yeah, go on. Um, so, the problem now is we have a German speaker here, I can't tell you anything, um, which was originally my plan, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna go on on that long word thing. Is that correct that I could build my whole life story in one word? Yeah, he, he's nodding. So, yeah. <laughs> he probably doesn't know German that well. <laughs> Anyway, so, long words, right. Um, we can build enormously long words, and the best example for that is probably numbers. Now, if you want to make a long word from numbers, you should use the number seven, because as in the English language, as in the German language, seven is the only digit which has two syllables. Ever thought about that? But yeah, it's true. So, I can give you one long word as a number, in German. 727 Billiarden, 737 Billionen, 747 Milliarden, 757 Millionen, 767.777. One word. Now, now, in English, this number is about 700 quadrillion. It's goes a lot faster if you say it that way. Um, yeah, so, but those are, those are arbitrary words that you just build by putting them together. They're not used normally in the language, and the longest word that is actually actively used in the German language, I wrote it down, because I can't remember stuff, I'm really bad at remembering stuff. Um, so, I'm also, yeah. <laughs> Um, the longest word is 
Rindfleischetikettierungsüberwachungsaufgabenübertragungsgesetz. And that is active in use in the German language. It's named for a law and because they don't want to write 63 characters every time, um, they made an abbreviation for it, which is called RÜAÜG, which is convenient. I mean, German people are lazy. Why would I type 63 word uh, letters if I can just make it four? Um, yeah, so that, that's a very long word. Unfortunately, um, it is not actively, not as active anymore because uh, this law doesn't exist anymore. You might not care, I don't care either, but I don't know why I told you that. Sorry. Um, now we come to the word, the longest word, which is also in the dictionary. Because just because it's a valid word doesn't mean it's in the dictionary. But this one is in the dictionary and it's Kraftfahrzeug Haftpflichtversicherung. It has 36 letters. Now, Kraftfahrzeug, German people are lazy, there's an abbreviation for that. It's called Kfz. Now, English is a lot smarter by just calling it car. <laughs> yeah, same amount of letters, but only one syllable. The, yeah, I mean, yeah. That's why I'm not speaking German, that's why, that's why I left my country and came here. Yeah? Just, just because of these things. Um, now if you were wondering uh, what the longest word in the English dictionary is, I also wrote that down. It's Pneumono Ultramicroscopic Silico Volcano Cosmiosis. Anybody know what that is? I don't either. I thought you would know maybe. But yeah, it has 45 characters, which is longer than the longest word in the German dictionary. Fun fact, woohoo, no one needs to know that. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. But now we come to the longest word ever on the planet, any language. Welsh, it, surely. It's a technical term, not Welsh. Um, it is the technical term for Titan. Such a nice short word, Titan. But then you can also say, oh, I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> now it, it starts with methane oil, something, 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 something goes on and on and on and on, and ends with isoleucine. Yeah, technical terms. Who cares? Um, it has 189. Thousand letters. What? So, yeah, for real. So, if you would like to pronounce it, it would take you three and a half hours. And there's actually a video on YouTube of a guy doing that. Takes him three and a half hours. Now, there are a lot of strange videos on YouTube. But I would not recommend watching this one, it's just boring. I mean, I, I watched the first few minutes and then it's just... The fun part is when you skip through to the half and then to the end, where at the, at the beginning he's pronouncing it properly and then in the middle he's getting bored and at the end he's holding his head and still speaking. <laughs> Actually, pretty funny, but that's the fun <laughs> part. Yeah. How can you make the most boring video funny? Skip through it. Okay, um, I mean, yeah, that's a cool thing about the English language, uh, the German language. Now to some not so cool things that Owen might know about. So we have three articles. You have one, you have that. Sometimes the, pronounced differently, but still, still only the one. We have three. Now, usually I would say, having more choice is good. For instance, if I want to buy ice cream, it's nice. Oh, there is chocolate, there is strawberry, and there is vanilla. But then if I want to have chocolate, and the guy says, no, you have to take strawberry. But I want chocolate. You have to, it, it, I don't make up the rules. Stupid grammar. Yeah, so... I mean, I could go on about the German language for, for, for a long time, but 
I see there's a guitar here. Can I just... I mean, okay, let's ask the audience. Do you want me to borrow the guitar and play a bit? Or do you want me to go on about the German language? Because I could do that. Yeah. Yeah. So, I don't know that one, sorry. Oh, it takes about three days, that's the question. Oh, no. Guitar! <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, let's make a vote. German language? Yes! <laughs> Guitar? Yeah. No. Can you play it? No. <laughs> but, but, but I can totally embarrass myself in front of a crowd of people. Go for it. Yes! Can I borrow your guitar, Larry? <laughs> Okay, sorry guys, we have to go on about the German language now. You can if you sit down and you stop moving around so <laughs> Wipe your hands. Okay. <laughs> oh. Sit down here. So we're gonna sing a song. <laughs> what is this song gonna be about? I have no idea. You tell me. What is this song about? Language. Language. German grammar. German grammar. Tennis ball. Sorry? Tennis ball. Uh, this is a song about the German language and tennis balls. Do you want the guitar in the Ah, this is gonna be terrible. But what do I care? <laughs> so, the German grammar is really fun. If you speak it, The German language is a pain Oh, that's just what I am saying German language is so cool That's why I'm sitting on this stool And I'm singing a song I could do that all night long German language and tennis balls That's what I sing about Doesn't rhyme I 
so